What's going on, guys? Unfortunately, we missed our first pick. We got really excited about opening Chalice of the Void, which is like 22 tickets. So that's pretty cool. Um, nothing else really in the pack, I guess. But um, yeah, we're going to take Urbis Protector for uh, number two. So I just said that I think white is one of the stronger colors in the format. Kettle Corn Jalapeno Chips. 100, 100 bits. Uh, hi, Frank. Hi, Mike. Mrs. Kettle Corn Jalapeno Chips says hi, too. Wow. Like you do. Amazing. Amazing. What are we taking here, man? Cortisar? I like a Cortisar. Do we like that better than Nizumi Cutthroat? I, I don't want to keep drafting. Better than black white. I don't want to keep drafting black white either. I just feel like I keep drafting it. We could also just take this Kindle and be red white and draft all the Kindles. Is that better Man. than Court Hussar? I think it's just Court Hussar. I think you're right. Oh, God. This is how they get us every time. But they do not have to get you. Just take the. There's nothing else better. I think this is the best card in the pack. Yeah. But do you want to be three colors? I think I want to be three colors, but I don't want to be four colors. Can we do that? Seems better than three colors or four colors. Could also take the guy that makes things unblockable. This guy's like this guy will come back though. I guarantee this guy will come back. And if we're only, if we're not taking a three color card, I have no reason to take a prism because then we'll just be two colors and I don't care about prism. I'd rather take like loyal sentry or something. I think it's just snake. <sighs> Lion's not bad, but, like, you get that effect so much more in uh, in Cloud Shift for one mana. And, like, then you don't have to expend another six mana to play Urbis Protector again. I took the Snake, man. Oh, Cultivate. I took a Snake, man. I think it's actually Prism here. Over Cultivate? I don't know if green is our main. Cultivate's so good, though. It is good. We can also just take Counterspell. Nah. And hold off on, on Snake until we get... Really? You don't like the counterspell? I guess I like it if we're actually blue-white. That's what I'm saying, boy! Uh, the filter lands are worth money. About 26 cents, 54 cents, stuff like that. I like Prism here too, hey. actually. Lower counterspell. All right, I'll take the counterspell. I wanted to, I wanted to be sold on counterspell. I wanted you to sell me on it. What about this Geist of the Moors? Seems good. It's better than Cloud Shift, probably. Yeah. What's worth ten bucks in paper? Snakes League to Milking. Rob taught us that. Worth the hard. Worth that. I like Prism here. Worth that hard money. I don't know what's going on here. Hush, my darling. Don't cry, my darling. Manike sleeps tonight. <laughs> Stays a little more open and still. What's going on in this chat right now? Cortisar again? Number dose. I feel like I always take Cortisar just because it's such good. Like, it's basically an impulse on a stick, right? Florida. Florida. Is it Noble Templar or Coral Helm or Accumulated Knowledge? I like two drop. You like two drop? Over Noble, noble Templi? Mm hmm. Really? Mm hmm. Really? Yes. I think it's this guy. Alright, take him then. See if I care. I will. I took him and I don't. About anything in your life, I'm out of here. You know Wow, this is aggressive. I don't like accumulated knowledge because it's a dead pick unless you get multiples. I don't like having two. I think three is the sweet spot. And I don't know if that's even good. Dang it. Do we take presents in case we had a crab? Probably. On a stick just means... Um, well, it's a, a stick means usually a creature because you're beating with it. Damn. Basically, a creature that does the same thing as a spell. Right. So, like, if you have a removal spell on a stick, it's it's a removal spell on something you can beat people with. 
which is weird, but man, what are you going to do? No Krabbies. Mike drafts and builds while Frank sits blindfold and eats a bag of jalapeno chips. <laughs> oh, I always refer to those as with legs. Oh, I see. You took the artif artifact nature and uh, assumed that it was a stick because a stick is a... Like a device. Like a... A stick is a device. Oh. Everybody remember that. I don't like you. So much do I not like you. A stick is a device. Everybody remember that. I just got a YouTube comment that said... Uh, where did, where did, was it? I think I deleted it. Probably. Oh, Shapeshifter is a good one. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's probably great. I'd like to take this counter spell, but Shapeshifter, Shapeshifter is gas. Shapey Shifty. Sticks are one of the simple machines, right? Planes, levers, sticks. <laughs> yeah, it's basically the same thing. Uh, Danny Death, if you want to, just e message me the link on Twitch and I'll, I'll share it. Or message to any of the mods and they can share it. It go yeah, it's plain lever stick. Those are the three. Uh... Also, I hope we get a brine elemental because then we just get the lock, right? Briny. Make Briny. Briny McBiney. How does that lock actually work? Uh, so you flip up Brine Elemental, and then you make this a copy of Brine Elemental, mm -hmm. and then uh, it says if you do, it becomes uh, uh, what does it say? Turn face up. You may choose another creature on the battlefield. If you do, it becomes a copy. At the beginning of your upkeep, you may turn it face down. Oh, okay. so you just I keep gotcha. doing it every turn. Not bad. Sundering Titan. Ooh. Yeah, I've seen this guy like four times. We played him once. Um. Eight mana is a lot. Eight mana is a lot, especially in like the non. But there isn't really much for us in this pack. I like a disenchant. It's also an arcane denial. Yeah. I mean, both of these are fine. We're not going to play this, like 100%. Take the disenchant. <gasps> Ooh, we don't have any crabs yet, though. Yet, but we could get one. Yeah, we don't have any red mana either. But we could get one. Okay, we're done. I'm going to take this Geist of the Moors number two. Also, we had pacifisms and like pillories in our last match. Don't you want to be protected? Don't you want to protect? No, I like to live on the edge. Yeah, I guess that's true. Red mana is free. That's a good point. I do love mountains. Oh my god, you guys are so ridiculous. Man, the speed with which you guys... This is, you guys, I'm impressed. You guys are impressive. You're not. Got him. Which banana are you, man? Probably like a 10. 10's pretty good. 10's a good banana. Mine's <gasps> acceptable. Ooh. You had some 15s the other day, man. Yeah, I was wondering why you guys didn't throw those out while I was gone. I, didn't just, I just didn't want to throw out your thing. If it's literally rotten, I feel like it's safe. I should have just ate them. When they were nines and tens. You should have. Yeah. Yeah, you should have. Yeah, you definitely could have. You could have been like, hey, man, these bananas look bad. You want me to eat them for you? I'd be like, yeah, sure, go ahead. I'd rather have not wasted them. Man, wasted bananas. God. Yeah, that's your that's your, your least favorite thing. I'm not tempted to take this now. But it's probably just this guy. Yeah, I like that guy. What do you think? Is it Piper or is it Mystic, guys? I'm gonna let let's let the chat let the chat decide. Why has Rob shortened his beard? Do you want to splash a Piper? Well, we also have a co a coaddle, a codal. You can turn old old bananas into breakfast shakes, but at a certain point, they're too bad for even that. Oh, did it. We did it, boys. Just kidding. We didn't do it. Yeah, we could have had two of those. What, accumulated knowledge? Yeah. Well, now we have one. 
I like it better than anything else in that pack. And I think we can get a second one. And maybe that's just fine. Fencing. Oh, Lion or, or, or Ace? Double Striker. Or Lion Man. Lion Man's good with Cortusar. It's also good with, like, it's just a good protecting card. We don't have any cloud shifts yet. I think Lion's pretty good. Oh, uh, we can do an honesty stream. We were doing it earlier. Mike was getting real with us. Can we do a lying stream? No. Because that's every stream with you. Wow. I ain't playing no Curse Catcher. Really? For real? You ain't playing that Vigilance guy? This guy? Yeah. I mean, we have one already. I guess we could play two, but I don't I don't like having this many six drops. What are we getting here? Fathom Seer? Turn to Island you control. That's pretty rough. It is rough. I'm just playing as a 1-3. <laughs> you can play him as a 1-3 and then bounce him later with a lion to get some value out of him. Might should be Primal Clay, though. I think it's Primal Clay. It blocks the uh, uh, the fear guys. Eh, I don't like any of these cards. They don't like you either. I can tell. Oh, Freed from the Real came back. Alright, whatever. Hi, Alyssa. Can we get a Jace one time? Just one time. I'm not asking for a lot here. One Jace. Oh, another ball lightning. Sure. Sometimes you just Not need excited? to sometimes you just need to open four ball lightnings, I guess. This pack is super unexciting. It's probably just cloud shift. Yeah. I think ordeal, but that's Nah. Yeah, Ball Lightning is almost Jace. It's almost the same thing. I feel like I'm just going to do these drafts until I get one Jace, and then I can... Retire. Yeah, then I can call it a day. Mike, honest question. If you could apologize to one person, who would it be and for what? Wow, that's a good one. Never for no reason. Okay, so honesty stream's over, I guess. Pacifism. These these picks are pretty automated right now. I like Angelic Page. I also like having a second accumulated knowledge, but I'm pretty sure we're just taking the pacifism. Because I put it in my pile. Oh, I like exclude a lot. Look, if we took that quick server dive, we can have a cascade bluffs. And we have a Krabby. We don't. But they're in the but same. But we would. When? How would we? When we whittled for it. We'd have a Krabby when we whittled for it. Yeah. I think we used up all of Mike's honesty on the first question about biggest regret in life. Yeah, I agree. I think it's just too late now. He just all right, doesn't. so for honesty, who would I apologize to? Yeah. I don't know. I don't I don't really have a reason to apologize to anybody that I can think of. He doesn't have a reason to apologize to anybody, <laughs> man. Well, that I can Woo. think of off the top of my head. I mean. This guy is serious, dude. I don't have a reason to apologize to anybody. Wow. That's late. That is late. Hunter. Ah. He's just licking all day, man. He's been doing that for like an hour. <laughs> oh, no, dude. He's just, all he does is lick, lick, lick. Hunter's he... got a licking problem. Lick, lick. I like your swamp shirt, Mikey. <laughs> oh, man. Is there a friend out there you wished you were nicer to? No. 
Mike just leads a boring life. He's like, I don't have any regrets. Or I don't have any. I had a regret. Yeah, you did. I think it's Man of War over Path of Peace, right? Yeah. Man of War is way better. Man, I wish there were more Jaces in these packs. There's just no Jaces whatsoever. Jace is missing. What are we taking here? Just Retraction Helix? Some of my patches still. <laughs> There's still time. You never know. God, how many counter spells is too many? Three? I think three is probably too many. I think I like Ghost Ship here. Some kind of Ghost Ship. God, another Geist of the Moors? Also a choking tethers. You're a choking tethers. Uh... Oh, if I could change three things about Mike, what would they be? Oh, boy. Oh, a sift? All right, this is actually great. This went well. Um. Oh, wow. This came... What? I would take this crab, but we only have a retraction helix right now. Yeah, that's pretty good. That's a combo. It is, but I don't know if it's a good one. All right, hold on. Now we got to make a cut. I think we can cut one Geist. Three things about Mike? Dang, that's a lot. To I don't I don't know if I have three things I want to change about him. This deck looks good, though. I think our last cut's probably one Noble Templar. You should just play Permission, and then when you've counted everything, play a Mana War and hit them ten times. I like that. That's a good strategy. Mike, Anna, Frank, if you could change one thing about yourself, what would you change? Um... Good question. A lot of self reflection happening in this chat. I would change myself into a millionaire. How about that? I feel like you don't understand. Only the, one million. I feel like you don't understand the concept of the honesty stream. You turn into a joking stream. Someone's got to have jokes, man. I, no, no, we're not lacking in jokes in this stream. What if we are? I'm just here to help. But we're not, so... But okay, that's one of the things I would change about Mike, is that he doesn't know how to be serious very often. <laughs> Why be serious? It's so lame. Uh, because it, it, sometimes it's necessary. Well, like at a funeral or something? Uh, no, just in general life. Just in everyday general life. Oh, like a funeral or something? No, man. Just like living, just like... <laughs> just waking up and being funeral. Alive. Alive. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh. Hmm. Uh... Wow. Wow what? Wow. Wow what? Why not attack first and then, and then play this guy so that your guy's untapped? What if I play a haste guy? Yeah, you didn't think about that, did you? Yeah, we're the serious boys, Lords of Honesty, bro. You I don't, don't know think that? We're that at all. Well, not when not with your attitude. Oh wow, look at this! Look at this beauty. I guess we'll take a planes. It's so beautiful. No. Oh. Would you rather have everything you eat to be too salty or not salty enough no matter how much salt you add? I'd, I'd go too salty. <laughs> yeah? Mm-hmm. You a salt boy? Indeed. See, look, now they might not be able to attack again if they don't have a green guy. If they don't have a green boy. 
they can't attack again. They're just going to have another timber pack wolf. I'll be honest. I, have, I don't feel like I've ever seen more than like one of these. Oh my god. Is that an infinite combo? No, it's whenever you cast. Oh, thank god. <laughs> that would be brutal. Oh, thank god, dude. Whoop, 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 whoop. I was like, that's busted. How did we never draft that before? Mike, what came first? Chicken or the egg? Honest answer. Chicken. Oh, we just got to bounce this idiot. It was clearly the chicken. Burner, burner, burner. I feel like our hand's very good. What about you? What do you think? What do you think about this hand? Okay. Another one. Wow. Mike, what is your favorite type of chip? And my wife would like to know what your favorite land is. My favorite land is an island. My favorite chip is, how, of course, the jalapeno. How do you not know that your chip. literal name is kettle, kettle corn jalapeno chips? How do you not know his favorite time, type of chips? What did you say your favorite land was? Island. That's your favorite land? Yeah. Huh. Oh, if we're just saying lands in general? Yeah, not like basic land. Oh. Um, if we're going with just lands in general, I really like Tolarian Academy because it makes lots of islands. Because it's utterly broken. It makes lots of islands. It's an island that makes other islands. What well, problem is? <laughs> Would you rather fight 50 size chicken size Franks or one Frank size chicken? <laughs> Please answer in 400 words or less. <laughs> oh my god. Ain't nobody got time for that. Like what's more delicious, the chicken or the egg? I would say the chicken. Honest question for both Mike and Frank. Which variant of the cosmological argument do you favor? The Kalam Leib Leibnizian or Aquinas' argument for con from contingency and why? <laughs> I'm going to... Uh, I'm going to hard pass on that because I literally understand zero of it. Also hard passing. Similar reason. I like to think of myself as an educated man, but that might be a little outside of my depth. Gonna just come on over with my boat. Choo choo in the sky. Chad, have you seen the comprehensive criticism of how islands don't look like islands anymore? Yeah, they don't look like islands. None of them look like islands anymore, and that criticism is actually fantastic. Let's take a look at our current islands. What do those look like? Uh, this does not look like an island. This literally looks like uh, a, 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 a river. Yeah. Yeah. If you're in between multiple pieces of land, you're not an island. Hmm. Oh, would you look at that? Mike says his favorite land is island, yet he's wearing a shirt with a swamp logo on it. <laughs> Alright, so this guy's gonna be a 5-5? Five five? A 5-5? Five five? I'll take it. If you wanna if you wanna pump that dude and and, and forfeit your entire turn. Don't you remember you told me you loved me, Mike B. Remember that song? No. Shut up. Wow. You guys should give us your votes. Our, our friend Felipe wants to go get some food tonight because he's been he's tired of eating at home. Um, Where do you guys think we should go eat? You can decide where we eat. Think of that. Uh, what do I think of the Jay Spellbook cards? I think they look awesome. Yeah, those are pretty dope. They look real sick. Uh, I worry about my own desire for play sets of them, but... Uh, you know, otherwise... Spice Town, USA. Like Guy Fieri would say. I guess he says Flavor Town. I feel like I just went to Chipotle like two, three days ago, so probably not Chipotle. Mike, say you say you buy a stock for two hundred dollars. One year later, it's worth a hundred dollars, and then the year after that, it's back up to two hundred. Was your return a zero or twenty five percent? 
think your return is zero at that point, it's right? Zero. Yes. There's a place in Ohio that does mozzarella sticks on a sandwich called Melt. You should go there. Boy, that sounds... Sounds delicious. It sounds nice and fat, I'll be honest with you. I have many cousins in Ohio. Maybe we can hook that up. Guess we're going. I had five whole eggs and half a roast chicken for a few hours a few hours ago, and I'm already hungry again. Good Lord. Five eggs and half a chicken? Dang. Spider, have a good night, buddy. No, no attacks here, huh? Well, this really shuts down my uh, your chip, my Turkish chip life. Your Turkish chip life. I feel like you heard me. I don't know why you're. I did. I just this. don't. I'll trade this wolf. This guy can't get I'm pumped, right? It. Plus C plus two. And... All right, target non flyer. Sure. Go get pizza. Honestly, question is pineapple belong in pizza. No. I refer to Gordon Ramsay. No. He says no. No. Oh my god, do they think they can quicksand this? <gasps> they thought they could quicksand it, and now that's it's super awkward because they have to sack a thing to give this flying, and it's a three for one, and oh my goodness god. I don't eat a lot of meat, so I don't want steak, unfortunately. Or fortunately, I guess, depends on... Uh, wait, what did they sacrifice? They sacrificed the token? Why don't you sacrifice this guy when you got the pacifism on it? Seems better, right? This is a fair trade. That's like a three for one. That's a two and a half for one, I guess. You got a thing? What is that? Oh my god, that's very good. I'm impressed. That was great. That was great on all levels. You've won my respect, sir. Oh, Jesus. I guess we're countering this guy. No soup for you. Don't be a land. Don't be a land. Just don't be a land. I don't want any more. Take them away. Leave my house. Don't be a land. All I know is that cheese is a kind of meat. And that's right. What was the teat part of that quote? Like a nugget from my teat. Frank, honest question alert. Lafof and I donate money for dinner. Will you guys stay at home, draft more, and eat Hungry Howie's pan crust on stream? Oh my god. <laughs> Well, I don't know. Maybe. That kind of excludes Felipe, though. It does. The problem is our friend Felipe wanted to. He was the one that wanted to go get dinner. Oh, Slider Man. Great question, by the way. What was the question? Sad you didn't get an honest answer. What? I did not. We, I said. What was his question? Oh, honest question for Mike and Frank. Some mathematicians believe in universals. Mathematical objects that exist independent of our conception of them. Others are nominalists and reject the platonic concept of ideals for believing that humans endow abstract concepts with, with meaning and that they don't exist independent of us. Which of these views are correct and why? Um, Excuse me? Okay, I would say there's definitely, uh, there's definitely universal constants and things that are independent of our, our perception of them. But it, it, that's a really interesting question because it's hard to prove, right? I can't prove that something exists independent of my perception of it because I can never see it from that perspective. So it's a really weird situation. It's a weird sitch. <laughs> so if this goes a 5-5, five, five, you can kill one ghost shipe. At what point is it worth letting a friend go? Oh, that's a good god. This is uh, when they run out of drugs to give you. Okay, you. <laughs> what does that even mean? You don't even do drugs. You don't know me. Yeah, no, I do. Nah. Yeah, no, I do. You know Jack Ship. <laughs> Jack Ship. Why does my opponent have all these cards? I don't understand what's happening right now. 
What are you doing for four mana? Oh, you're just pumping this guy. Okay, good. Yeah, that's fine. Try to go ship in a, in a, for a guy with a thing. For a guy with a thing. Your time's running out, buddy. You can go to Sunny's. It's like the constant. I, I worry that... Well, Sunny's is like... I want to spend less than like 15 bucks. Okay. Would you rather be Michael Scott or Michael Scarn? Explain your answer. <laughs> okay, that's a good question. Um, do we get to be No Scad? Thank you so much for two months. Really appreciate it. Still, what does it say? Still like home. Nice, nice. So, it's an interesting question. Are we referring to Michael Scarn? Actually, can I do this? One, two, three, four, five. No, I, I got I tap all the things and I get to cast this guy. Um, are we referring to Michael Scarn as he, Michael Scott wants him to be, or the it's, or the reality of Threat and Level Midnight, the movie? That was a good. That was a good movie. Man, it's funny because we've been watching The Office and uh, we're like, we have three episodes left. We're almost done. And we could have just order pizza and then just watch The Office later. That'd be good too. That's what someone suggested. Well, yeah, but we wouldn't be drafting. We'd be watching The Office. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Duh. Unbelievable. Oh, this is scary because it actually kills our mystic. Our mystic Snakeu. Or they can block here and quicksand this guy. Oh, man. I feel like none of our attacks are great. I guess we can attack with this guy, and if you want to give this guy float, we can regen. All right, cool. Hey, Mike, if they don't think it, it'd be like it is, then how come it do? <laughs> is that a wire quote? It feels wiry. You don't think it'd be like it is, but it do. What? Shut up. What? Shut up. What? Shut up! What? Why don't you just shut up? Never. I know. Boy, do I know. We're gonna give this dude float and attack for six? That's brutal. Ready? Here we go. What are you, sack of planes? God, I knew it. You're so predictable. Well, now I'm never keep now I'm never attacking with this ghost ship again. Ghost ride ship. <laughs> oh, sick! Hot draws coming through. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, that's good. Ghost ride your ship. One, two, three, four, five. This guy gets in there. That's pretty good. This guy also gets in there. This is match one. You attack with the unblockable guy? No, because then they just quicksand it. You no. know how quicksand works? No. Has anyone really been far even as decided to use even go want to do look more like? Yeah, I think so. It's a good question. I think th I think they have, though. Oh, sweet tomatoes. That's a good idea. Don't hate it. And that's also cheap, too. It's like 10 bones. For you. Mine's 11. Yeah, because you don't you don't use my coupon. I don't feel like you offered it to me. It's always up for offer, bro. Okay. I'll keep that in mind. LaFope, what's going on, buddy? Welcome back. How much I need to donate for you to go to your next event in a furry costume? Um, Well, probably more than you're willing to. <laughs> Let's put it that way. <laughs> also, likely, I don't even know when my next event would be, so. Let's get the money now. Think about it later. Huh, that's a good question. Serious question. Between M25, Commander Anthology 2, C18, Corset 19, Battle Bond, Elves vs. Inventors, Signature Spellbook, and Challenger decks, are Watsi kicking the other side of this MTG a wee bit this year? I mean, I know 25th anniversary and all, but come on. Um, so, M25, isn't that the same? Don't they release a master set every like year anyway? 
I don't know if I can't say because I don't know if this is more or less than normal years. Twenty five K. Okay, so I wouldn't want it to be like any sort of like sexualized furry costume, because that's super weird and not okay. Um just wear a furry hat. I don't know what that is. It's like a hat with ears and stuff, like animals. You never you ever seen those? I don't like the connotation that has. LaFo for trying to get Frank and Mike to eat Hungry Howie's on stream and break a record for stream length. Also, the Odyssey stream has taken over. <laughs> How much would I have to donate to get you to do a stream in a furry costume while drafting only furry thing? I, um, I, I really want to, to stop using the word furry, though, because there's a weird implication there that I'm not comfortable with. Um, can we say animal-themed costume, an animal-themed deck? That, that would make me more comfortable, personally. Oh man, good times. We're having a good time. Oh, another another Savannah Lyon. I like this ghost ship because it can just it can just block this guy all day. Oh, I guess we just win the game. Hooray. It's murder. Alright, do we have anything that we can Disenchant seems good because they had uh they had a pass no, we had a pacifism. They had the Valor, and they had the, the Luminarch thing. Right? Mm -hmm. Okay, good call. Disenchant comes in. I'm of the school of thought that if I board a card into the deck, I can just I don't have to take anything out, so. Uh, I don't actually mind. I, yeah, I mean, I, I don't know if it's the talk of the costumes, that is making me hungry for Chicago style deep dish so much as the fact that I'm just getting hungry in general, but how much would I have to donate for either Mike or to you and either Mike or illusions to do a 20? I am real, real reluctant to do 24 hour streams. Um, it's brutal. Yeah, it is. Ex it's just exhausting. Like emotionally and, and mentally and physically it's exhausting in every aspect. Like I've been streaming for four hours now and I could not imagine streaming for 20 more hours because I just can't. Like, it's just exhausting. I don't get it. Are you as a viewer going to watch for 24 hours, too? Like, Yeah, like, no one does that. No one watches for the whole 24 hours. I don't get it. Can we do it in shifts? And, like, the 24-hour streams are weird because it feels like you're just challenging yourself. Old Chicago double decaroni deep dish is a pretty good version of bread with stuff on it. I agree. If you're ever in Chicago, look me up. I'll take it. Oh, we could, I would definitely go to some Pequods with you, no beats. I am I am familiar with Pequods. They are good They are good stuff. Apparently, it's real good. Oh, Frank streams eight hours. Mike streams eight hours. Frank and Mike stream eight hours. Um, That still seems pretty rough. Because then Mike is streaming for 16 hours in a row. Uh, and I don't know if yeah. you ever see that happening. He doesn't even sleep for 16 I would just fall hours. asleep on the keyboard. He would, actually. But I would still be streaming, so. That's true. You didn't say we'd have to be awake for that. Is sleeping on stream a thing you can do? I am two, just to be clear with you guys, I'm two subs away from the highest um, number of subs I've ever had. Uh, it dropped a lot when I stopped streaming, but now I've been streaming regularly for like four months now. And uh, at least five days a week. And I'm two subs away from my highest sub amount ever. And I'm three subs away from breaking that, which is super exciting to me. So thank you guys so much for all the support. I forgot we had this guy, but we didn't have Brian Elemental. I got real excited because I was like, oh, we had this cool combo in here, but... Um, we did not. Oh my god, I really want to know what the no beats, um, the link was. I already paid a few Mike Sleep at... <laughs> it's probably like MikeSleeping.com. Oh, Frank stream eight hours, Mike stream eight hours, Rob streams eight hours. Everybody wins. There you go. I think they ban you if you sleep on stream. What if you just literally pass out from exhaustion? It's not like a deliberate sleep stream. Hunter on stream for 24 hours. Oh, that sounds good. I would watch that. I feel like I do. I feel like that's just my life. What are you doing over there? Nothing. That's, yeah, that's the story of your life, man. I 
I caught the tail end of one of Caleb's 24 hour streams and I was like, I, how are you not really tired right now? Well, I bet he was tired. Took three Timberwolves in pack one. Didn't see one of the next. Oh, that's weird. I think three is still good. Like, there are two twos for two at worst. Which is great in this format, I think. Are you, what are you doing, man? Why are you constantly rubbing your face against the mic? I don't understand. <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with support. You. I'm sorry, what? It's a good support. That's Meme City, man. He rubs his face on it to claim it at his own and not Rob's. <laughs> yeah, that sounds about right. He hits a wall around five to seven hours left, but hits an adrenaline rush within the last couple. That's weird, man. Bodies are weird. Is our opponent... Did our opponent leave? Is he just like, I'm done? Come on, Rob Dog. Rob Dog Douglas. Your sober acoustic son is stroking out. Call 911 now. <laughs> All right, let's go over some of these cards. All right, we got Academy Drake. Meh. I mean, it's good and limited, right? Like, yeah, sure. You got limited. a two-two flyer for three early, and then like late game for seven mana, you get a, you get an air elemental for two more mana. Sapperling migration. You get two mana. You get two one ones. If it's kicked, you make four one ones. So, again, pretty good. Two one two power for two mana in the early game, or six mana for or four six mana for four power in the late game. That's uh, mm. that's a pretty good, huh? It's okay. You don't like it? Eh, I don't know if I play it. Would you play? I play. I mean, if you play a two, if it's a, it's a format where you play two twos for twos. Well, we can't do a set review as a whole yet because it's it's not out yet. It's literally. I I will plan on doing one when it comes out though because that was fun and I I think we had a good time. Knight of Grace. This card looks insane. Two two for two. Uncommon. Um, I like that they brought these like these these specific knights back that are like protection from either like the black knight that's protection from white or the white knight that's protection from black. So. But a text proof now, yeah. which is weird yeah but it's still good right like is, yeah well it's okay so there's a little there's a couple caveats one means you can you can target this with you can target it with black stuff the other one is that like it doesn't have protection from black creatures you know oh true so like they can still block it with their black creatures and knight of grace gets plus one plus one as long as any player controls black permanent so it's a three two with it does have first strike though so it's pretty good but like these these this just seems like a, a really solid guy two two first strike for two mana hex proof from one of the major removal colors And Flame of Killed. All right, so that was it. That Most was all the cards. Kill. I don't know what that is. Oh, you didn't see this one? These are new Saga cards. Are you familiar with these? Yeah, the upkeep. You put a counter on them, right? Uh, after you draw, after your draw step. So and as it enters is, the battlefield, the first time is discard your hand. He, yeah, that's what I said. I don't like that. That seems very bad. I do not like. The second mode is draw two cards. That's pretty good. The third mode is if Red Source would control, you deal damage to a player. This turn deals that damage plus two to the permanent player instead. That does not seem that great. Right, especially because you have to consider, like, after you put the third counter, you sacrifice it. So, like, yeah. this only happens for one turn, and then you're done. It's really weird. Yeah, discard your hand is not not great. We talked about how, like, it might be good in, like, a dredge deck, where, like, you play it on turn two, get rid of your hand. Oh, sure. And then the next turn, you draw two, so you can dredge two cards. But outside of that... That's a lot of lands. I uh, I would like them to stop now. Do not touch my ghost ship, huh? Oh, goody. My favorite. The double timber pack wall. I feel like you guys are looking at this card from the perspective of a blue mage rather than a red. Yeah, of course. Of course. But that's how I look at cards. If you know what I'm saying. I think you do. Even in red, like, discard your hand. Like, if you have one burn spell left, even then you're like, okay, now I'm drawing two random cards. It could just be mountains, like, 
Right, and then like you're all in on the oh god, I guess I'll just take the one card that's not two more lands. One, two, three, four, six, seven. Eight. We've seen eight lands so far. Oh, see. I'm considering venturing out in the snow for a draft, but I'm having separation anxiety since you've been on the background as I've been working all day. I'm afraid if I walk away from our voice, tiny demons will crawl into my ear and bite my eardrums. Have you gotten this problem before from a fan? What do I do? Honesty only, please, no jokes. <laughs> I mean, this is an interesting play. You just play this on this guy and then attack? Now I can just... I don't understand what... I don't understand. Now I can just kill it? You understand nothing. I don't. I don't. I haven't actually had that problem yet, but I appreciate... I'm glad you were my first, Matthew. I'm glad you were my first, buddy. That's interesting that they literally just threw that on there. I'm confused. Vigilance? Oh, man. Look how, look how strong... Matthew Ori, Elk Tears is also named Matthew. That's that's his real name. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna block because if you want to pump, like that's fine. Because I'd rather waste the pump here than on my ghost ship. Oh no, act of heroism. Man, look at all these counter spells we got. We have one. We also got exclude. Correction, we have two. <laughs> God, what a dummy, am I right, people? But that's only like half a counter spell. You're half a counter. Oh, I guess. <laughs> okay. Because it can't counter non creatures. Wow. Look at that hasty pump. It's just like, I'll pump it right now. Luke is leaving again. I thought we were going to... Yeah. What a crazy dude. Oh, boy. Don't call your acoustic son a dummy. I, I can't care. Honest question, Frank. Are the precious drafts on this stream worth watching? Anything good? I came on during the start of the current... Wait, what? Are the precious drafts on this stream worth watching? That's for you to decide. I don't know what that means. Oh, you meant to say previous. Oh, that makes much more sense. I was like, wow, precious? That's so nice of you. All right, I guess we just lose this. He pumps the... the I don't understand what just happened. Well, we died. No, we, we didn't, though. We died. I don't... We died. It's all over. What? Who is the better cook, Frank or Mike? Uh, I don't know. I don't know how much... I don't know. I'm not too familiar with Mike's cooking. It's probably me, though. I say you cook more often, so... I, like, never cook. You used to cook more in Seattle. I did. No, you don't anymore. I don't. Unbelievable. That's a that's a jam I just made up. How do you get people to just fold? I have to play full games of Magic to win my league. Well, I mean, we haven't won many leagues. We have two trophies out of like 12, 15 drafts or something. Uh, chicken parm or veal parm or eggplant parm? Definitely eggplant parm for me. Uh, I like chicken parm a lot, but I try to eat uh, as little meat as I can because I'm just I, I just like animals more than I like meat so um, I do like chicken parm but if I have the option I think the taste difference between chicken parm and eggplant parm is so negligible that I will just rather eat eggplant parm I would go with chicky parm no. I'm not a big fan of veal because not only the concept of it but I actually don't really enjoy the taste I've only had it once but that's enough I think It is kind of messed up that Mike never cooks for his dad. 
Eggplant is gas, and eggplant is basically a meat, I think. I like this hand. Double counterspell. We got Mana War and Geistums. My name is Michael Barbablibu. I would deal with killing the baby cat. Why would you say that, though? I don't understand. I tell you I don't eat meat because I like animals more than meat, but that's your response? That's super weird. I, yeah, all right. Well, that's... Eggplant parm's pretty good. An eggplant is kind of a meat. Oh, Habzul. I had the same problem when I lived in uh, Seattle. It was very hard to... Oh, we lived in Kent, actually, and it was very hard to find good, like, Italian places. Um, so I actually just made a lot of... Italian food myself. If why do you, if you you say you've never had eggplant or most vegetables, but you try to eat as few vegetables as possible, like why? Why do you try to eat as few as possible if you've never eaten that many? That doesn't make any sense to me. Try a vegetable, maybe you'll like it. Right, like I mean, it's like it's a, it's a weird position to take when you don't. It's like a that's like a completely uneducated position, right? Like I I've decided to do as little of this thing as possible that I've never experienced fully. So that's a weird. Oh, the old animals are made out of meat joke. That's a that's a good one. Yeah, sorry guys. Like I actually I I I'm a big animal fan. I'm a big animal advocate, and um, I I just prefer if this 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 chat doesn't devolve into uh, animal. I like animals too. They're super tasty, like stuff like that. It's just not. I I, I personally I love you guys. You guys are all awesome. I just don't find it terribly funny. I have pets. Like, I mean, like, I look at my dog and I'm like, it's, you know, culturally, there's there's no difference between eating my dog and eating a cow, right? Like, there's, it just depends on what culture you're born in, what culture you're raised in. Um, so, I don't know. It, it's just, I, I prefer, um, uh, neither bacon nor bacon. I think America's obsession with bacon is kind of perverse and really awkward. I think the way America fetishizes bacon and puts it on t-shirts and makes band-aids. It's like, it's just super, it's super weird. I'm actually just going to bounce this guy. Like, and I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't begrudge anyone for eating meat. Like, go ahead, eat meat. I'm not going to judge you at all. Like you do what you do. You, you eat, you eat what you want. I'm just asking you, uh, as a preference, as a, as a, as a request, just don't rub it in my face. I think bacon is overhyped in America. I think it's overhyped to like a uh, an obnoxious degree. Like it's super awkward. Was it me or you that just shoved the butt end of a pound of broccoli into my mouth because Michael told me to? Uh, I actually think that was... Who was that? That was Kevin. That was Kevin Malone. Uh, there's... there. I think there is vegan pet food, but it's not good for animals. Like... Uh, I am an American. I'm speaking as an American who who is... Like... Uh, comment, comment, commentating on American culture. Like, I feel like I'm in a good position to do so. This feels pretty good. I wish we could find a good, like, vegan Asian place. Like that place in Seattle it was so good. Or in my vegetarian place Renton? was great. Renton, Renton. I bet there's some here. I wouldn't be surprised.
Yeah, most Asian places do have a ton of, of vegetarian or vegan options. It's just weird to me. Like, I mean, I don't even care if you eat, like, eat, eat whatever you want. Like, I'm never going to begrudge someone of what they eat. But, like... Twisted A bomb in response? It's an interesting choice. Oh, white main lion? I can just bounce my mana war here. But do I want to? Probably. Like, it's just better to have the mana war in hand, right? I've given him an opportunity, though. Yeah, I mean, that's true. I didn't know the line had flash. Oh yeah, otherwise it's just terrible. I think it'd be alright. It would just be terrible. I would love if they played Living Death here. That'd be great. You could counterspell it. That would, that would be the point. Oh, a little bat? A little batterino? God, I didn't get to double that ability? That's pretty good. Oh, they're not going to? Nope, they are. That's pretty good. Well, we're not going to bounce that dude, that's for sure. Did the sound cut out? I hope not. That would be real sad. So here's a question, do you eat fish? It always confuses me that some people don't include fish in their definition of meat. Uh, I don't eat fish, but that's just because I never really... I'm also not a vegetarian. Don't get me wrong. I do eat chicken. I do eat turkey. Like, I don't... Um, I don't... I try to eat as little of it as possible. Eating those has just been the compromise I made with myself because it's... It's just easier for me. But, I mean, you know... Like I said, I'm not begrudging anyone of their dietary habits. Are you anti-meat? What did it ever do to you? Uh, it actually murdered the animals that I consider valuable sentient beings. And that's what it did. <laughs> it sounds real dark when you say it like that, but you're asking a loaded question, so. Um, yeah, I feel like we have to counter that guy. He's pretty strong. We have no way to really kill him or get him off the board is the problem. Hmm. One, two, three. Court Hussar. Number dose. I would actually like to get off the meat topic as well. It's also socially awkward explaining why you don't eat meat because it's just like this chat. Yeah, I, I, yeah, it's really weird. Like I have to explain to people why I value animals as a species, like as a living, as a, as a, as a living like a thing. You know, it's just very strange to me. But. You know, it is what it is. Uh, the meat talk was... I didn't actually start the meat talk. Someone asked us a question, so... Oh, come on. Really? That's so good. Wow, that's so insane. Was there a punt? What was the punt? Trying to figure out what the punt was. Yeah, uh, saying Adolf Hitler was a dedicated vegetarian and animal rights guy is a really weird thing to say. Um, not sure what you're getting at. <laughs> so. Uh, 
<laughs> Karakong, nice. <laughs> Actually hilarious. I'm trying to get them to think there was a punt. I believe vegan cheese is just made with nuts. Like it has something to do with like, you're like made just of, like almond milk. And you're made like of that. nuts. <laughs> Got him. You know, I guess he did. I guess he's he did. made of nuts. Oh, uh, the saga cards are interesting to me. Um, <laughs> the saga cards are interesting. Um, oh, look, the their own pacifism. Because it seems like there's such little, like every phase of the of the card gets like one, like you get one use out of it, right? Oh my god, this. I'm really actually impressed with the Strionic Resonator in this matchup right now. I think our opponent's really going to town with it. What a great sift. Okay. 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 7, 8, 9, 11. Okay, well... I mean, I feel like they are setting up for a... Uh, well, no, they couldn't be setting up for... They wouldn't be trading with our guys if they were setting up for uh, Living Death, but maybe they were, because maybe they bring back two... Well, they only got one one bat in the graveyard, I guess. It's going to be Living End. Nope, it's just going to be Twisted A-Bomb. All right. Also, if they had Living End, they'd probably just cycle this guy. Wow, the top... Another great draw. Five cards have been lands. Good lord. All right, everybody, good luck sitting through these weird meat talks. Thanks for the great day stream. By the way, why is Frank Castle sitting behind you? And what has he done with Sober Robert? Uh, what has been my favorite movie of 2018 so far? That's a good question. I just wanted to beat Admiral Akbar. Yeah, don't we all? Don't we all? Where is Alan Beck, by the way? Uh, I don't feel like we're going to win this match just because lands are a thing. Biovisionary, thank you so much. Really appreciate the uh, the cheers. Uh, what's my favorite movie of 2018? I feel like there hasn't been a lot, right? I wish I could remember the movies I've seen in 2018. I'm going to look up movies released in 2018. Oh, it's going to... It's showing all the movies that will be released. I don't know. So far, I'd probably say Black Panther. Oh! Actually, I'd probably say Disaster Artist. Good lord, man. This guy is just brutal. Yeah, last shit I was in 2017. It was in Christmas. You're in Christmas? Christmas. Sweet Christmas! Sweet Jiminy Christmas. Incredibles 2 looks pretty sick, too. Disaster Artist was 2017, too? Was it? What was? Disaster Artist? No. Oh, it had to be. Yeah, because... Yeah, it had to be. Because I know some some people who saw it over Christmas. Yeah, can't win. <laughs> can't win this way. Can't win this way. We didn't see any other artifacts than this idiot. So I don't even know if it's worth bringing in a disenchant. I guess the only move I've actually seen in 2018 is Black Panther. Wow. Dang. I mean, we drew like six lands in a row. Like, that's pretty brutal. I don't actually know how anyone wins at that rate. You don't. I know. I know. Uh, no, it's not a room remake. It's actually the story of the making of the room. The James Franco's playing uh, Tommy Wiseau, and like they're actually showing that the you know the movie being made and like the process behind it and everything. Yep, keep. We got a pickle boy. It really that's not a pickle boy. It's a pickle boy. It's a pickle boy. It's not but he has no pickles. Yeah, if you haven't seen the room, don't see I mean you can see the disaster artist. It'd probably be fine, but like I, it's just not as good. See the room first. Do yourself a favor. 
Have you guys watched Altered Carbon? No, I don't know what that is. It's a Netflix show. They're going to take my Cortusar, aren't they? That's rude. I didn't know you were a Marvel fan, but you have the Marvel channel on your Discord. I, You didn't know I was a Marvel fan? Holy smokes, man. Holy smokes. They didn't take... Wow, they didn't take Court Hussey. That makes me feel some kind of way. Ooh, Man of War? Prob. We already have a ghost ship. Is Can you have too many ghost ships, though? Yeah. I don't think so, man. I'm just going to be ghost shipping all day. Ghost mm. shipping. Ship it. Chocolate chip it. Bjorn, are you muted? I don't think so. Do you want to be? I'll mute you. I'll mute you all day, buddy. No way, man. Superhero Comics for life. Do you have a... You, you're going you're gonna to disfigure my guy? Which figure? You think they got uh, White Mane Lion? Little Lion Man? Little Lion Boy. I was a little Lion Boy once. No, you weren't. You don't know my life. You don't know my Lion Boy story. This is a little Lion Man story. This is a little... I'm a little lad who loves baddies. Have you not seen that commercial? I don't think so. We're going to watch it right now, and we're going to hope that that doesn't oh, get Oh, I might have seen this. You, of course, Everyone has seen this. We, I think we just watched it on YouTube the other day. You tried these new berries and cream starburst? Pardon me. What kind of starburst did you just say? Berries. Berries? Berries and what else? And cream. Oh! Oh! Berries and cream. Berries and cream. I'm a little lad who loves berries and cream. Berries and cream. Berries and cream. Oh, I'm a little lad who loves berries and cream. There you go, man. Never forget. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty good. Actually, we didn't watch it together. I watched that at Chris's house with uh, with Chris and Chris when we were in Seattle. I just got you confused. Wow. Wow. Comics is an expensive hobby. You are not wrong. What's our opponent doing? Living deathing us? What'd you just do? Did you just I dab? scratched my neck. It looks like you were dabbing. This looks like dabbing to you? Uh, it, I didn't see all of you. It looked like you were doing this. Oh. It looked like a dab. Shut up. Shut up. Did you scratch it again? Yeah. Scratch all day. Do you scratch all day? All day, boy. I scratch all day and I scratch all night. My name is Mike and I'm going to... I'm a little lad who loves berries and cream. <laughs> Did you know that, man? I didn't know that. Now you know. Oh. Wow. Now you know. You little lad, you little lad who loves berries and cream, you. This is a good draw because now we can play this guy and keep this up. Live in that dream. This guy just dying here? What's happening? When this if you if you copy the trigger on this guy, do I get the card twice? I think I'm gonna get off and get food and attempt to feel slightly better and not just curl up and cry later if you aren't still on. Thanks for the Hey, kinda right. Have a good uh, have a good stream, Bucko. Uh this looks like it comes back. Just counter this though. You could. You could also not. All these things are true. Hmm. I'm a 
of a lad who loves berries and cr my concern is that they just take the counter spell they're probably gonna do that I just want him to go to the graveyard bounce the hussar with what I mean we could we could blink it but then it just dies like that ain't good I guess we actually could have blinked it and then this guy wouldn't have died I like getting our, our doppelgangster back. I'm just going to play this guy. I'm going to assume you don't have a living end because that would be really scary. Okay, that, that probably says you don't. God, living end is like my... It's like my night. It's like my fear now. My dad. Like living in triggers me in this in this in this format. My dad. Oh no! A bird. A bird McMurd. It's Birda. <laughs> did you like that? Yeah, you did. It's your boy, Birda. Yeah, you did. What? Why are you like this? Just explain why you're like this. You don't need it. It's not. He's literally stroking out right now. It's it's actually terrifying. I think this is lethal. Got him! Oh, they didn't let us do a thing. That's how you do it. When your opponent doesn't do it, do it. Screw it. Did you know that a bird is a word? I did hear that once. Um, it's... I think that's still being scientifically proven whether a bird is in fact a word. But um, I think all signs are pointing to yes so far what about a burb i don't know what a burb is well you never will then frank is there a platform that is better for you for contact you can contact you, i give you can just contact me on facebook we're facebook friends right hello frank's lapora and castle <laughs> oh man hey bro let me ask you something I don't want to ask you anything anymore. Okay. I'm done with you. Also, if you guys want, uh, I'll figure I'll let you know now. I do do deck critiques. So if you guys are interested, I would li I, I like taking a look at your deck. I do, if you guys want to donate, um, I have the link. I have the, 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 de the details in my Twitch profile. I don't have anything for Saturday, uh, which I do standard. And I don't have anything for Monday, which I do modern. Um, so if you guys were interested in something like that, uh, feel free to reach out. Let me know. Um, but just wanted to throw that out there because that is something I offer. And uh, I'll like play the deck. I play the deck through a league. I give you guys feedback. I give you I suggest changes. And uh, then I post it on YouTube. So I would like to point out that you said doo-doo. Preach. Good looking out. Good looking out. Hey man, you see my you see my new my new phone my new phone background? No. Oh. Hey, look at that. So oh, what do you know? That's Thanos and uh, and Silver Surfy. And Silver Surfy. <laughs> oh boy, this hand is just hot garbage. Oh, this is better, but I'm not thrilled. This is better it. garbage. God, I hate putting that murder of crows on the bottom. And they didn't mulligan because God, they never did. It do, was do they. a murder of crows. <laughs> Give you have a good night, buddy. Your your mother's a murderer of crows. Wow. Yeah. I didn't even know. Yeah, and you'll never know again. I'll never know again. You'll never know again, buddy. It didn't even make any sense. Wow. 
What did you say to me? I think he's just making noises into the microphone. I have no idea what he's doing. That guy was really happy. Your mother's really happy. Is she? No, she's probably miserable because you're her son. <laughs> Boom! <Wow>. Roasted! <laughs> That's messed up, man. That's so messed up. Yeah, it was pretty dark. Oh, we'll, we'll clearly take this one card that we don't have multiples of in our hand. So that's cool. Oh, they didn't do anything. That's great. I love it when I love it when they pass with three mana and then they don't do anything. It's my favorite. Oh, they just drew? Oh, this is great. Everything's coming up Millhouse right now. Serious question is Dauntless Bodyguard the new choice one drop for modern death and taxes. I believe it is protecting the th What is Dauntless Bodyguard? I don't even know what that thing is. I spelt it wrong, but Google will, Google will correct. All right, so it's a 2-1 for one, I presume? I have to assume it's one. As it enters the battlefield, choose another creature you control. Sacrifice the spot. I got the chosen creature. Gets inter oh, interesting. But you have to choose it after, like... How can it be a one drop? I guess you can either vial it in. Oh, the old N-H-J-K-L-J-O-P-O-I-I-U-W-U-Y-T-E-R-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E
Okay. Okay. Did you hear what I said? I believe you said bouquet. Like a bouquet of flowers. We just put them to six next turn if they don't have a thing? They gotta have a disfigure, right? Which figure? This, this one. one. Wow. Oh, wow. That's a good draw. This is weird. So we just keep up Counterspell? How do they beat this? I don't think they do. Are they going to lie in this guy? Little lion man. It's not a man. It's just a regular lion. Oh, that's a good point. Thank you. I appreciate your correcting me. Look. Look, it is a lion. Look with your lion. Look with your lion man. I don't actually care about that. I would rather keep my geists alive. Great geists alive. You got it. I lost my pacifism. So now they still have the horror of the Zebrooken lands. Hmm. Well, that's going to take my counter spell. So I guess we just counter it, right? Yep. All right, you got it. Hope you don't have living death, I guess. Or mountain pyroclasm. <laughs> yeah, right. Both of those are bad. Because then they get Primal Clay, Twisted Abomination, Mesmeric Fiend, and Geist of the Moors back. And that would be like... Oh, they cycled it. Alright, we're good. We survived. They're looking for an answer. They just said, send me an angel. Right now. Oh, they, they got the angel. Well, that gives them a turn. Does it though? Yes. Does it? Yes. Let's uh, let's think about it, Michael. It's really not much to think about. I uh, think you should think about it. No blocks. I'll take one. One whole Dumage. Mm -hmm. So do we just play Ghost Quarter or Ghost Ship or do we just search and play Cortusar number two? I think it's probably Cortusar number two because it lets us play Urbis Protector and we already have Lethal on board. Ghost Ship doesn't increase our clock any, so. Cloud Shift seems pretty okay. I like Mana War too. Could just take Island to guarantee the Protector. I feel like we don't need it, though, if we have Cloud Shift, because then we can save one of these guys from anything. All right. Yeah, I like Cloud Shift better here. I wish we had another land to do it, but I think we're still in pretty good shape, Arenos. Oh, another Cycler. All right, well, you're you're definitely gearing up to that living, end, that you, living death that you un assuredly have. All right, I got nothing. Do your worst. Okay, that's not living in, but that does put you up to seven, which is really frustrating. Wow, I'm really surprised Tyrannic Resonator is having this good of an effect in the game. Hmm, interesting. See, that was the other reason why we didn't take the land, because... We drew it anyway. going to draw it anyway. I'm not afraid anymore. I'm not afraid any Geist of the Moors. They have one card in hand? Wow, that's great. Our hand is gas.
Unless their last card is literally... Um... <laughs> living Death. God, I'm so afraid of this card. I feel like they would have played it by now. So I do too. They also have to have it. It's a rare. That's annoying, but... Whatever. So they get two copies of this? Sure. Stop, stop ghost shipping me, bro. What do you take here? You gotta take clown shift. I mean, both of these are bad, right? Like, we just, we just flip this up and copy this every single turn. Can we do that? Yes. Okay, that's good. They have one card. Is it a disfigure? If it was a disfigure, you would have killed the Geist of the Moors. So, I don't think it's a disfigure. Unless you just drew it. Well, it said, it said casting, so I wouldn't be surprised if... Uh, Nothing, huh? Okay. So, Andrew's Battle Hound, you can choose another creature on the battlefield if it becomes a copy of that creature. Seems good, right? Yeah, not bad. Okay. So you go block here, block here. Yeah, I don't need a risk protector anymore. So you go to two. And plus, Herbus Protector being in the graveyard gives us some insurance against something like Living Death. So you got to deal with two angels right now. I have my doubts. It won't be, yeah, it won't need to be if you unmorph it. That's why you have to cast it normally. Oh, we did it. Wow, we're 2 0. I'm liking it. Are you liking it? Are you loving it? Gotta have it. Do you, what? I thought we were naming the the uh, sizes from the ice cream shop. What I like it, love and gotta have it. Is that Coldstone? Yeah. Huh. <laughs> don't you? If you're going to the cold, if you're going to Coldstone, don't you gotta have any size you get? No. You can flip the guy anytime, anytime you wanted. Yeah. Oh, Chupa Copper would have done it, but that's an uncommon. I mean. If I called it, they would have had it, I'm sure, but... Good thing you didn't, eh? Oh, thank goodness. Fingers crossed, I guess. I, we're done, so I guess I don't have to cross them anymore. I'll be back. Where are you going? Gonna Good take business. gonna take a little boop? Yeah, man, I'm gonna take a little boop. All right, well, Mike's out of here. I'll see you later, Mike. All right, let's, uh, let's, let's finish it up. We don't have any packs left, so we might just actually do Phantoms. Or we might just play... Uh, I'll keep this hand 100% of the time. Or we might just play some uh, some Arena tomorrow. MTG Arena. Well, we're going to do that anyway, so be sure to give me a follow or a subscribe if you want to support the channel and check that out. So. We'll also be uploading our Arena adventures to YouTube, undoubtedly. I guess Mike left because he, he got to have it. I guess that's what happened. Another black-white deck? God. Don't these people ever have enough? 
Uh, I am in the beta, yes. I haven't played much of it because I just don't think it's... Like, it's it's hard to take my attention away from, like, regular magic. I don't know what to take here. I think it's actually just Loyal Sentry, to be quite honest. Like, I don't like... Uh, I like lo keeping up playing Loyal Sentry next turn and keeping up Exclude. That seems good. Wow. That's sad. I guess we'll take three, though. Yeah, playing Ixalan Block Constructed does not sound enjoyable. If you don't attack with Fiend Hunter here, we know that. I guess we just block here. Oh, I'll take another three. God, I wish we had a, uh, a lion there. A little lion, man. It's just a 2 2? God, I don't care about that at all. <laughs> yeah, go ahead. I, I wish we didn't click it, though, because it said paying cost. Arena is a kind of PvP, and wow, that's true. You're, you got a good point there. I hate that if we uh, we Path of Peace the Fiend Hunter, we only get an impulse. We don't get actually our card back. That guy we will counter. Mana War. Oh, Mana War and Fiend Hunter seems pretty good. I like that. And then next turn, if we don't actually... Oh, this is this is actually real good. And then if we don't use Cloud Shift, which we're not going to, we can just Urbis Protector immediately and get the Cloud Shift back. That's pretty insane. Oh, this guy actually just dies, doesn't he? I forgot. I thought it went back to our hand for some reason. Still pretty good. Oh, that was such a great draw. Oh, my God. They can target our mana where we can just bounce it. And then, oh, my God, this is great. We're doing really well right now. And this is even better. Wow, this is real okay. We could have blinked Mana War there, but I think actually just letting Fiend Hunter take this guy and then playing Urbis Protector and Cloud Shifting it seems just better. Why not White Mane our guy before he died? Didn't we do that? Oh, the Court Hussar? Um, we took the White Mane off of the Court Hussar. Oh, because he triggers, we could have done that? Yeah, I, I, that would have been fine. Um, no, actually, I like this. This is fine. Mm, yeah, sure. Oh, that guy's pretty scary. We might just Path of Peace that guy and bounce your... It's whatever. This is not a guy we want you to have him play. I want you to get rid of the, the Fiend Hunter so that we don't have to worry about losing an Angel to a Fiend Hunter. Yeah, that's actually exactly what we wanted to happen. So you have a Ram in hand. Yeah, I'm going to assume you didn't draw this figure. The fire's in your eyes, and the ones I feel are clear. Just beat it. What you want? And now we have, wow. Yes, we have everything right now. I mean, we might even just assume in Shapeshifter and not really care about a counter spell here. Like, what do we take? We take two. 
No, I think it's actually fine to keep Counterspell up here. I don't want to actually play Vesuvian Shapeshifter face down because then we don't get any of the ETB triggers. Whereas if they play like Chupacabra, I'd rather just definitely counter that. Wow. They go to 11? 4, 8, 9, 10. Oh, that's so frustrating. Yeah, I counter this. <laughs> as much as I'd love you to... It doesn't increase our clock. Oh my Lemon. god. Okay, please don't. God, you do that every time. It freaks me the hell out. This is actually pretty busted. Untapping an angel and blocking Fiend Hunter and Dark Dusk Zealot, and we get our mana war back. Fiend Hunter first, just in case. Doesn't really matter. God's willing. Sure. Well, that was your last card. They put it on top. That's pretty scary. Because then you turn it into something else and they can't get the dude back. Actually, that does seem pretty good. That'll do, I guess. All right. They didn't want to draw another card. <laughs> Even though, Well, they knew it was on top, I guess, so. Yeah, that went pretty well. I don't really think we need any sideboard cards for this matchup. I feel like we're in good shape. Turn one Blood Moon. I think Biovisionary removed your quote and just re-added it with um, like correct grammar because we were talking about that earlier. So like capitalized G a period at the end. So because I was complaining about how like the the, the incorrect grammar on some of the quotes like bugs me. Triggered. I, I did. I, I got triggered. Hunter, stop. It's not the one with him on it, though, which is, like, that's the one Doing I want. This? Yeah, yeah, that's the one I want. I wish I could get that. It's got to be out there. Let's look up Triggered H3H3. This is the only one that comes up. It's this, but it's just, actually, maybe the 11 second one is... Oh, is it just that? It's right out of you. That's so bad. See, if we draw a plane we'll be sad that we can't cast Geist of the Moors, but we can still cast Shapeshifter face down, so. Actually, I think I just bounced this guy. Let me get to know what it is. No secrets. As Radiohead would say, no alarms and no surprises. Oh, it's a ripper. I, wow, that's weird they didn't flip it in response. Do they just not have another black card in hand? Because that's two free damage. Not only was that Radiohead quote, it was a more obscure song. Congratulations. What song is that? No alarms and no it's surprises. It's called No Surprises, I believe. I like that clap you did there. It's literally called No Surprises, yeah. It's a kid, that's an OK Computer. That's an, that's an, wow, OK Computer is 20 years old. That makes me feel old, dude. This, rever this record was revolutionary, dude. This is a record, and I, I, this is, OK Computer was a, was a record I listened to, and I was like, wow, these guys are infinitely smarter than I am.
All right, Geist of the Moor, we get it. You you vape, you lift, you lift and vape. I think I'm just gonna assume shapeshifter, copy mana war, and bounce mana war. That seems good, right? Bouncing again, bounce bouncing again. Oh, it's my Griffin Protector, Gryffindor Protector. Oh, that's good too. Let's do all the things. The shapeshifter isn't putting in work. Choose a creature. Bounce the old man of war. Next turn we can pacify and uh So your shapeshifter has been putting in work, and that ain't no joke. And it flips down next turn so we can copy something else. Woo! Flips down. Ooh, dropped my phone on the way to dinner and cracked it. Plus they're out of oranges. Oh my god. Dude, the oranges is just the icing on that on that cracked phone cake. The most delicious of flavors. Cracked phone cake. I love it when they spend their whole turn drawing three when they don't really have that big of a You know what? If you got the disfigure, you got it. I'll 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 eat it. You do. They always have it. You got it. Nailed it. It's like you knew you were going to get hit by that bus, but you let it hit you anyway. Would you like to turn this dude face down? Yes. Use Mana Wars ability. Ha ha ha. It's funny because it is not Mana War ability. Put that bird in your hand. Oh, turn one blood moon. We were definitely aware of the pickles lock. We just didn't happen to get the other half. We didn't get the pickle, the actual pickle. What's going on, brutality? You might say we cucumbered, but we didn't pickle. That's true. We did not. We're yeah. We we got the we got the cuke, but we didn't. We're not able to brine it. So. Hmm. I think we just. Are you gonna take this guy? Don't ever take my Vesuvian Shapeshifter again. Do I want to copy? What do I copy? I guess I got to copy something, right? I guess I'll copy your Fiend Hunter. And then I'll steal my own Mana War? That doesn't seem good, right? Oh, actually, we should have stolen the Fiend Hunter, and then it never comes back. If we flip it down. Dang, that would have been good. They might just murder it, though. Oh, no, they just... Ruthless Rippy. Ripperino. Rest in pepperonis, I guess. He's just saying all kinds of nonsense right now. Rest in Ronies. I think if this is actually a planes, we just take it. Because not only do we have two cards, no, not a single planes was found that day. We'll just take Counterspell. Nah, no good attacks here. So chat, what do I want to do with the rest of my day? Probably hide under a blanket, right? Something happened. Clambert 34, thanks so much, buddy. You're my favorite Clambert. I don't think we care. Do we care about this? I don't think we care about this. We have ghost ships for days. We do need one more land. Like, one more land for ghost ship or Geist of the Moor is really where you want to be. You're real chatty, buddy. Exercise and read a book are actually good suggestions. I think if you're feeling um, a little bit bad about your day, I think exercise is actually a great, a great option. Walking really helps for me. Take a look in a book, reading rainbow. I will block your ruthless ripper, and assume you're not trying to juke me out here. You revealed a ruthless ripper to a ruthless ripper. Oh my There's god! Too many ruthless herpes. So many bong rippers. 
Uh, Kyle, I don't know if everyone else is as well versed in the trumpet as you are, my friend. Is it me or does that morph kind of have like a wrath of God? It does. It's really weird, right? Uh, I'm not going to turn it face down right now. I don't think we have a reason to do that. Oh, God. Where's my second white source, dude? Somewhere. Some type of where? Somewhere out, out there, there beneath the pale moonlight. That's a, that's a five old, that's an American tail jam right there, guys. <laughs> We keep it classic. Oh, I don't like that. I'll counter that. Yeah, it's pretty annoying. Four one ones is not where I want you to be when I got this sad of a board state going on. Maybe just block this guy too. Like I don't care about any of these guys, and we want to set the. I don't. I want you to have nothing on board. Phyrexian ghoul. I don't care about that, especially because I'm just eating all your guys, man. Let me get herbus protector. Let me get an herb, an herb, an herbus. Herbs the Werb. That's not an herb. Nor is it the Werb. It is neither the herb nor the Werb. Rock the herb, don't rock the herb, baby. Rock the herb, don't dip the herb over. I feel like we're doing well here. Despite our lack of white manners. I was, uh... Yeah. Yeah. I only have textbooks in the last... Oh, come on with that. That's sad. And we block here and you just... I'm just going to take it. If you want to deal me six, that's fine. You'll get, you'll deal me four at least, I'm sure. I'll take one. I will turn you upside down, though. You turn me upside down. Because we can actually... Oh, that's so good! <laughs> that was real good. Hey, that's pretty good. Where does the exiled card go? The exiled card go? No, nowhere. Oh. It just stays exiled forever. Rip. Rip and pepperonis. God, again, one more land would be great here because then we can cast this, 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 or this. Five land has really been our... Uh, I will block and you can sack your Fiend Hunter if you'd like. No, you're going to do a thing? God's willing. That seems worse than getting rid of just a boring old Fiend Hunter. That is not the... Ah! Tell me how you really feel. And I'll never tell you. God, Lord, just give me one... Where's my planes at, boy? You can just block and regenerate, right? I could just cast this and steal this guy, right? That also works. And then flip, copy you, eat you. Do you sacrifice it? Interesting. Some type of way. Wow. That's pretty good. We gained four, though. That's comfortable. Also, our hand is still gas, so... Planes. Oh my god, are you kidding me right now? It's ridiculous. It's just like a it's just like a bad joke at this point. I mean we're just gonna attack here, put them to three, and then kill them with uh the morph next turn, so I guess it doesn't really matter. Like you have two cards that you can draw here. Or two cards that you can possibly have to deal with this guy. Like right now we take four. All right, you have one card. No blocks. That 
that's actually great because now it's game. Beautiful and another another island. Amazing. Games. Sweet. Yeah, promise of Boonray would have been pretty pretty busted there. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. If you guys haven't done so, slam those like and subscribe buttons and uh, make sure you uh, check out my YouTube because uh, I post videos every day at 11 a.m. Eastern time and I'm starting to post them at 11 p.m. Eastern time as well, so twice a day. Gives you guys something to catch up on and uh, I'll see you guys next time.